The Office of Interprofessional Education at the University of Buffalo was looking for a resource that would allow us to teach health profession students early in their training the core principles of interprofessional collaboration, such as teamwork and communication. Some of the problems that we see with just health profession students in general are living in silos. And oftentimes we may not ask for help or know who to ask for help. It's important that our students learn about the value of working in teams with other health professionals before they even get to the clinical setting. When they graduate, the expectation is that they work together effectively on a team with other health professionals. I think it was four years ago that we first heard about Friday Night at the ER. Friday Night at the ER is a simulation learning game that mimics a hospital environment. And so the game board is divided into four departments. The students, each one is managing a portion of the hospital. And the game simulates a 24-hour period where the individual departments are faced with a number of challenges each hour. There's three other people from other professions at the table with them while they're playing. So in that time, they get to interact with at least three other professions. There are lots of ways to educate, but there's nothing that beats experiential learning. They come in and their heart is racing and they're nervous and they feel like they have a lot of responsibility on them even though it's just a board game and it's very low stakes. Actually going through that kind of an experience and having those emotions and having the feelings and learning in that way, it's a deeper level of learning. This experiential learning opportunity is valuable to students because it allows them to learn from their mistakes. It makes learning about these concepts different, and then they have a lot of those aha moments. Friday night at the ER really allowed us the opportunity to emphasize the importance of teamwork, collaboration, innovation, systems thinking early in their training. We build upon those concepts, kind of threaded throughout our whole curriculum purposefully. Compared to other solutions that we've explored in the IPE program, Friday Night at the ER has definitely been one we've been able to scale very quickly because of how successful it's been. We started with a small pilot of 60 students, and over the course of three years, we are now offering this program to over 800 students. Medicine is a team sport, and if we have great clinicians who are collaborators, data-driven thinkers who can be innovative, I think those are gonna be the best providers that we have out there.